here for this year's 2016 Runners World International photo shoot. So we're incredibly lucky to have um, cover stars from all over the world. A lot of them are very, very good runners indeed and running 21s and 10s and up to the marathon distance. Um, we've got people from South America, we've got people from the United States and of course from South Africa. Cape Town has a huge variety of locations, um, also locations that could work around the world. Um, we've also got a great selection of models here who are also runners, so it's great to have models with the running experience so that they can you know, have a connection with the readers of the magazine. Uh, these covers appear throughout the next year in far away as Australia and Spain and Italy, South America and the US as well. An ideal Runner's World cover should be a very realistic, enjoyable running moment in an everyday running location where the runner is not, you know, smiling too big, not overly posed, but in a natural form, just enjoying it, enjoying what they're doing. I think what people forget about these cover shoots is they're actually a lot of fun. Um, we do have a lot of time putting it together, making sure we got gear from all over the world, many different shoe brands and, uh, and equipment that we have to use over the three days of the shoot. But it is a lot of fun and we get a chance to shoot a lot of stock photography, which is the stuff that appears inside the magazine, and we use the models to do that as well. Um, but most of all, we have a great team of people, we have fantastic models, we've got some of the best photographers in the world, and uh, we look forward to giving the rest of our partners fantastic images at the end of it all.